Imagine you're walking down the street at night. You encounter a beautiful woman walking ahead of you, wearing a beautiful kimono. She turns around and smiles at you. You gasp. But then you realize she has made black paint over her teeth. You wonder, why? Well, first of all, the paint is a solution called kinemizu. Secondly, she's a geisha trying to preserve her history and culture. Now I know you'll be wondering why on earth anyone would like to stain their teeth black. So let's dive into the video to better understand this. Staining teeth black is an ancient tradition and it is called as ohagru in Japan. Ohagru was not only limited to Japan but it was widely practiced in Thailand, Myanmar, China and Vietnam. Why they stained their teeth black? Simple. Beauty. Black teeth were a symbol of beauty and maturity in ancient Japan. It is believed that it was first done to indicate one's entering into adulthood. Young boys and girls of age 15 stained their teeth to indicate that they are adults now. Later in Heian period, both males and females started staining their teeth to show that they belonged to a noble family. Black teeth became a symbol of higher status. How did they stain their teeth black, you asked? By making a solution called Kanemizu. This black solution was made by ferret acetate from iron fillings mixed with tannin from tea or vegetables. Interesting solution, right? It took a lot of time to prepare and once it was prepared, it was applied with the help of a feather brush. Some historians believe that ohagru was only practiced by married women to make themselves unattractive to others. Others believe that it was also practiced by unmarried people who wanted to show signs of maturity. Anyways, ohagru persisted for a long time in Japanese culture. But after the arrival of Europeans in Japan, ohagru became an old tradition. Foreigners often associated it with poor teeth hygiene. It became so unpopular that the Meiji government finally banned it in 1870. which made it more unpopular but thanks to these beautiful geishas and meiko this ancient tradition of ohagru has continued i believe that the next time you come across a woman with black teeth you won't be scared